The BMW Active Hybrid 5 is BMW's latest 5 Series hybrid. Unlike the previous generation hybrids from BMW, this car is not a mild hybrid. It actually has a full-blown hybrid transmission. It's much smoother and has a little bit more torque to it for a low-end acceleration. With a combined fuel economy of 37 miles to the gallon or, or thereabouts on the EPA cycle, this is not going to win prizes as the most fuel-efficient car on the planet. However, the BMW Active Hybrid 5 is not really designed primarily as a hybrid. It's a hybrid with a luxury feel to it. Now, as you'd expect, the Active Hybrid 5 really does handle well on this hill course uh, in Millbrook in the UK. And although it's a big car, it's quite nimble around this twisty hill circuit. Bury your foot to the floor and it reminds you that it's a BMW at heart. The BMW Active Hybrid 5 has a very smooth feel to it. It's very refined, very German. One of the things I like about the Active Hybrid 5 already is its head-up display. It's telling me just above my steering wheel how fast I'm going. And believe me, with 306 horsepower under the bonnet, you really don't want to take your eyes off the road, especially not when you're on a tight, twisty hill course like this. Inside the Active Hybrid 5 is all of the usual accoutrement that you would expect of a car of this size and price. BMW has always been about producing cars that perform without compromise and it's certainly true in this case. However, I do feel that the hybrid system is not that smooth around town. But bury your foot to the floor and you go from 0 to 60 in about 5.9 seconds. I'm already doing 90. Now I'm doing 100. Right now we're doing 70 miles an hour which at freeway speeds is extremely quiet and well refined. I can honestly say that the Active Hybrid 5 is the first hybrid that I've driven that doesn't feel like a hybrid. I mean, at so speeds, you've got that whine from the electric motor and it reminds you that, yes, everything's OK. And it is green, sort of. But underneath, Underneath that hybrid niceness is a, a beast waiting to get out. And that puts a smile on your face. This car is big enough and comfortable enough and competent enough to function as a fun commuter for long distance drivers who have to drive regularly. But it can also function wonderfully as a fun plaything. Just don't let your right foot dictate what you do all the time. Otherwise, I have a suspicion that your gas bill will not be quite as good as you might think. This has been Nikki Gordon-Bleenfield for Green Car Reports.